Charlie. You're a kind, fun, loving, and patient, but most of all, patient. You rarely judge me for my horrible taste in shows. You let me think I'm the funniest person in the world, and you handle my multiple eccentric but lovely personalities quite well. You tried to paint my nails when COVID had my nail salon closed, and though I love you for trying, we're never gonna try that again. You really are an amazing person. I'm so lucky to have you forever. <laughs> Samantha, I would have never guessed that when I used Tucker to trick you into dating me that he would pick you to be his forever mom, but he does have incredible judgment. It didn't take me long to realize what Tucker knew right away. You exude all the qualities that I lack. You are thoughtful, sensitive, and compassionate. Some people might even say stubborn, but I'll stick with strong will. <laughs> you think you're the funniest person alive, which as a result makes me laugh, so maybe you are right. <laughs> and despite your hatred for feet, you were there multiple times a day to wiggle my toe after my foot surgery. I love you, and I promise to spend the rest of my life attempting to match the qualities you display and prove to you that this tin man can have a heart. <laughs> wow, wow. Okay, this is almost uh, redundant, but I have to say it. And but we're going to combine it together. We're not going to ask each separately. We're going to ask them together. Do you, Charlie and Sam, <laughs> take each other to be the husband and wife, to be the spouses for each other, promising to protect and cherish each other in good times and through adversity, and seek life together as long as you both shall live? I do. In that case, we need the rings. On the mat. On the mat. Oh, on, on the mat. mat. <laughs> <laughs> Those who didn't say that the greatest invention, they were so afraid that the ring is going to fall through the cracks of the, of the, of the deck. <laughs> with this ring. What do I say? With this ring, I be wed. With this ring, I be wed. <laughs> as my beloved and my beloved is mine. There you go. Yeah. With this ring, I be wed. As. <laughs> My That's my beloved, and my beloved is mine. In Hebrew, that whole thing is two words. And you, you know, again, you never know. The dictionary may cost a lot of money them days. So they combine <laughs> everything in two words. Dodi, li, and li. Dodi means my betrothal to me, and me to my betrothal. You may kiss the bride if you like. <laughs> <laughs> and the last word. One more test for Charlie to pass. <laughs> most people pass it. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm not most people. Most people pass it. The idea is to stomp on the glass, to create a noise. There's a thousand explanations why you do it. The one I subscribe to is it penetrates a heaven to make room for this new beautiful couple. So if the bride and groom will take there's the glass over there in the, in the, right there. And Charlie was, I have to admit, the only, he wasn't worried about marrying Sam, he wasn't worried about anything. He was worrying about what would happen if he missed the glass. <laughs> All right. All right. There you go. Are you going to hold it? You trust me? <laughs> you can't miss it.